it's your girl Anitra here with Different by Design where faith and fashion connect and I'm coming to you today with another video. If you are returning to my channel to watch another one of my videos, hey girl hey, if this is your first time stopping by my channel, welcome. Just make yourself at home. Just click the like button, click the subscribe button, click the notification bell so you can stay tuned for all things faith and fashion. Okay y'all, so welcome back to my channel. Um, <sighs> so many things with this video y'all so let's just discuss how this box pick it up without showing my address this box which is now basically empty this box and this bag has been sitting since a couple days before my birthday which was january um patiently waiting for me to make a haul video and now that I am making this video in March, I decided instead of just doing a basic run of the mill, look what I got from Shein Hall, I said, why not create some transitional looks, some transitional outfits that work winter to spring because this weather is very much, what season is this? And tonight is actually the night that the clocks spring forward. I need that hour, y'all. I don't know about y'all, but I need that hour. Um, tonight is the night that the clock spring forward. I said, let's play and let's play. Let's create some looks. Let's give the girlies some ideas. Let's just have fun with this video because not only are there pieces from Shein, I've also acquired a couple items from Target and Le Amazon. And so I figured, yes, let's just play. Let's just have fun we have in this video we have several shirt dresses that'll be styled various different ways we have open cardigans we have uh pleated skirts we have sweaters we have a denim trench we have some wide leg elevated casual sweats with pockets we have so many things we have several different size discoveries you guys might have been right about my sizes and we'll discuss that but without further ado if you are interested in seeing any of these transitional looks you should probably have snacks by now get yourself a drink a comfortable place to sit on your couch um make yourself at home sit back relax stay tuned okay so i don't know how much of this outfit you guys can actually see and i hate that for us okay so let's quickly revisit this white shirt dress from a previous Shein haul um this is what she looks like and so i have her paired with what will forever be known as my birthday boots <laughs> okay my pink boots that I got from Journey Collection. And so I have had this outfit idea in my head for forever now, and I could not wait to style it. This item here is from Le Maison, okay? I don't know how many times this cardigan was suggested to me online, how many times I've seen other fashion girly style her, and we are finally here and I've had this outfit idea in my head for a while now and now that we're here I'm not sure how I feel I don't know I don't know how much of this y'all can see I'm gonna put this other boot on and y'all tell me what you think <laughs> y'all tell me what you think of this look I was thinking this would be a good transitional moment spring to summer not spring to summer winter to spring I don't know what what this look is getting as I stand in front of this mirror I don't know this night this might not be giving what I thought it would give y'all tell me I'm thinking I'm thinking I, don't, I thought I could put like some stockings with this 
definitely not black. Maybe some, mm -mm. this ain't it. This ain't it. Maybe if I put jeans on with it, I don't know. I don't know if it's the length of the cardigan or what, but this is not giving what I thought it was going to give. I don't know, but again, y'all tell me with these pink boots. Maybe. I don't know what bag I would style this with. I was thinking my chalk. Let me see. Please hold. I don't know. I was thinking this to keep it from being too matchy matchy instead of going with like a pink bag. This was this has been in my head for a while. But that's why you play in your closet. Y'all know every every how to style video on my channel comes with an epic fail moment. I don't know if this is that look. I think if I play around with this some more, it'll be what I needed it to be. What y'all think? What y'all think? With the right accessories? What y'all think? Mm. I don't know. I'll keep y'all posted. If y'all happen to see this look, revisited, restyled in a vlog. Don't be surprised. Next slide, please. Now I figured while I had on this white uh, button down shirt dress, I said, well, let me show them the green coat sweater, the green coat uh, blanket scarf situation. Go to get the green coat, realize this is already in my closet, okay? This is already in my closet. Is there any similarity? No, so. It is what it is. But this is why I said we're on no buy because girl shop your closet. But this is the coat that came to mind when I saw this scarf. And low key, if I had worn this scarf, I wouldn't have sounded like Barry White the past couple days because I came down with ammonia because I was walking around like it was already spring with no coat on and no scarf. And so this this is a moment. This coat came from Boo Boo. Uh, and so I just felt like this was the perfect combination. Next slide, please. <laughs> I just felt like this was the next, this perfect combination, like I said, with either one of my XXL Kensington bags, which I cannot reach right now. But matter of fact, let me give you all the full moment. Okay, so we have styling options. Again, if you can still see the pink boots, act like you can. But we can go here with it, with the button down white, some jeans, some basic white sneakers, or we can go here with it, also jeans, basic white button down, and some white sneakers. Cute sunnies, this coat, is an uh-uh, it's exclusive. It the girl, can you put this in your pocket for me? Uh-uh. But it can definitely fit in our bag. And so there you have that. This is a moment. This is a look. Tell me what you think about everything but the boots. <laughs> okay, in the comments below. <laughs> okay, so next item. Next items are from my birthday haul. This tea. Little Miss Ice Coffee all year long. Yes, that's me. It is me, I am her, okay? And so I was just so happy I got this for my birthday because it explains me. Now tell me why she has pink hair. That just, listen, it's me all day. And so you guys, we have discussed this problematic piece from the Target, from Target that I found the day after my birthday. And I was back and forth about whether or not I was going to return her but I decided to keep her because I missed the return window. And so there is that. I forgot to tell you guys in this video, I'm not wearing any shapewear whatsoever. This is me as is, okay? So you can get the true, the true look. The, this is a button down shirt dress, but I told you guys that the slits are high on the side. And so I have decided for the sake of this video to see how she fares as a duster 
and I have her paired with my old faithful wide leg super distressed jeans. This was not the shirt I planned to style with this look. I was going to try see how it fared with a white turtleneck underneath. Completely forgot that I forgot to bring the turtleneck. I'm not looking for anything else. I was like, this might be a cute look as like a dress down situation. As you can see, the shirt dress is green and white stripes. The tee is green and it has the white in it. And so I was just like, let's think about our bag options. This is actually a very cute outfit. I'm also currently thinking about what I wanted to wear to church tomorrow. So there's that. Um, I was like, we have a couple bag options. I was like, let's, maybe we can go here with the shoe because um, she has pink hair. These shoes are actually rose gold. It will either be this shoe or a neutral, a neutral uh, pump, which is also something I have to search for. So for the sake of time and my nerves, we want to rock with this. And so I was like, we have a couple bag options. I was like, let's reach for some things that we never reach for, like this little extra, extra small Ava. She might be cute with this look, but I was like, you know what? We can do, we can go here because this bag actually has the colors of the shirt. It has the green, it has the pink in the hair. It has the two colors here. And so I feel like this is a better moment. So I'm like, this would be cute together. I probably wouldn't wear this to service. I probably wear this to like chill on a weekend. I don't know where I'm going with this look. But this is cute together. And so I'm actually low key grateful that I didn't bring the white turtleneck. Cause I felt like if I put this on with the white turtleneck, I probably would have been annoyed at, at the outcome. But these two, two are cute together. And with this little bag that I never reach for, this is cute together. I like this, it's different. This needs to be a thumbnail outfit. <laughs> Let me know what you think in the comments below. Next slide, please. I was like, sis, pick up one more green item. Here, pick up one more green item. All right, so here we have, <laughs> now it has green in it, but it is what it is. Here we have from the Black History Month collection, we have one of the HBCU tees. This is a lip tee. Um, I went through a lot with this shirt. This is a, double X um, and I I don't know if I've mentioned the sizes for the other items that I've shown you guys the sizes that I'm wearing the name of the the real name of the item and the link to all the available pieces will be listed in the description so the T is from Target these camel pants which I in on the website they looked navy blue camo but in person, they are very much black and gray. I said, let's put this together. And I feel like this is a moment. Now, this is not the complete look because I figured as soon as I saw this tee and this dress, I was like, oh yes, this is a moment. So we have this long red pinstripe shirt dress from Shein. I told you there are several shirt dresses in this haul, in this uh, styling video. And I was like, this will be cute together. This is a moment. Listen, this shirt is a movement by itself, okay? But with this outfit, it is a force when they are together, okay? Now, you'll also notice that my name has changed multiple times in this video. I have to keep it rearranging these bubble letters <laughs> so it's actually my name but this dress is a moment i have this dress in several colors um i've shown you guys how i styled a the black version and so this is a look now because we have a couple metallic options we have the the gold fronts and then we have the christmas ornament which is silver 
we have shoe options, okay? We can go either way. We can go either way. We can go either way with our shoes. I also have, where are they? These little numbers here, which I purchased from Sheet and last year have not worn them yet, but I feel like this is too red. Like it, it kind of goes, it goes with the shirt dress, but it doesn't really go with the tee, but I have a couple shoe options. I don't know what tap recital, what dance recital I was getting ready to be in, why I have all these Mary Jane style platform shoes, but we have a couple shoe items. And then we also, again, we have bag options. We can go either way. This is the carry of the day, actually. We could also carry this, of course, without the toilet scarf. Um, we also, of course, we can go green, but for right now, we could also go here with our bright poppy Georgie Jim. And because it's silver hardware, we would probably go with the silver shoe. But yes, y'all, the world is your oyster. So fast, yeah. The world is your oyster with this look. Now, these shirt dresses do not have pockets, which I'm like, in 2024, why are we still making dresses with no pockets? All designers know the joy we feel when we discover a dress has pockets. And here we are, dresses with no pockets. Make it make sense. Thankfully, the pants have pockets. Now with these pants, I will say, I did not try these pants on in time to realize that I pr probably should have sized up. These pants are a 2X, they do not have stretch. I probably would have fared better with a three just so they'd be a little bit more roomy. But I tried to get a similar sizing to um, my Cadet Kim pants that I got from Fashion Nova. They're actually one X. Those pants are a 1X. I have them in green and I also have them in like a maroon and pink camo situation. And I figured these would, I mean, they're basically the same pants just from a different brand. And the only difference is the Cadet Kims have like on the inside, they have similar to like Tyler clothes, the little um, adjustable thing to like make the waist smaller or bigger. These don't have that. And so they do have an elastic waist in the back, but uh, yeah, I don't know. I feel like maybe with shapewear, it'll fit a little neater. But like, again, like I said, this is the outfits without shapewear. Tell me what you think in the comments below. Okay, so these two pieces, which I am strongly leaning towards wearing tomorrow for service, but I'm not quite sure. These are both Shein pieces. So we have this lovely chevron uh, designed sweater. It's very lightweight. Um, if it's a cold day, you could put like a turtleneck under it. I probably wouldn't just because I feel like this is already high up enough on my neck. Um, you could put like maybe a cami or a long sleeve uh, tee under if you need a little bit more warmth. And then we have this long floor length pleated floral uh, skirt. And when I saw one, I was like, oh, they would go perfectly together. Now this is what the sweater looks like. Absolutely not. Like how old are you, girl? You must style it up. And so we just do the little courtesy tuck a little bit. Of course I would tuck it better than that, but you just do the little tuck to give it a little a little something. And for shoes, again, we have options. I'm leaning toward these Mr. Brown's fashionable daughter boots. Listen, everybody wants to go to the rodeo. Everybody wants to be a cowgirl. And so I feel like this gives like, if Mary J. Blige went to the Houston rodeo, I, this is like, this is what that is, okay? You get a little yeehaw with a little aura and be, listen, break up the matchy matchy. If you don't go here with a neutral shoe, 
because the skirt does have white in it. If you don't go here with the neutral shoe, again, you can go metallic. And I love a good purple with silver. You can go here with it and boots don't fall. And so as far as bag options, that will be determined by what shoe I choose. And so we have our bold pink Penny 25. Now this has gold hardware, so I wouldn't do the silver shoe. I probably would just go white boot. Um, if I don't go this, this way, I think that includes um, if I decide to break out one of my Michael Kors bags that I never carry, white boot. If I choose to go tabby box bag minus this twilly, I would go silver. Okay, because she has silver hardware. And so there you have it. Low key. Hmm. Y'all tell me what you think. Again, minus the twilly scarf. I just tuck it. Decisions, decisions. I'm trying not to go too matchy matchy, but I think this could this could work. This could work. But again, the skirt is floor length. The only reason why I'm not putting the shoes on in the video is because my head is already at the top, and I feel like because I have limited space, something's going to suffer. So I'm just showing you guys the shoe so you can get the gist. But there you have it. So whatever color shoe I choose will determine the color uh, jewelry I wear because of course the shoe determines the bag, the bag hardware determines the jewelry. It's a thing with me. So yes, I mean, I could even go here with it if I wanted to. We have options. Where else could we go? We could also go, of course, we could pull out the pillow Madison shoulder bag. We have a lot of options for this outfit. We have several white bags, chalk bags. We have, we have a lot to choose from. But yes, y'all, I'm not sure if I'm going to wear this tomorrow. But we shall see. It's definitely a moment. It's definitely a look. Let's see, how can we tuck this a little cuter? It's a, it, this is a thing with me. Go here, go here, go here. Of course, the skirt does not have pockets. And I don't know why this purple, this purple is eggplant, but in my camera is re reading very much brown. <laughs> I don't know why, but this is a moment. Tell me what you think in the comments below. Oh, hey, hey, how you doing? Listen, let me stop playing. So this dress is not a part of the haul. We are shopping my closet temporarily. This dress came from Le Amazon uh, last year. And so <clears throat> I have this shirt dress on. This is the very first shirt dress that opened the floodgates for me to just find all the pinstripe shirt dresses. I have this shirt dress on because this next look, um, like I said, I'm showing you various ways to style shirt dresses for transitional styling moments. This next piece is another pleated skirt. It is basically the bold print version of the pleated skirt I just showed you guys. So when I saw this skirt, I was like, ooh, it will be perfect with this sweater that I showed you guys in my open Christmas presents uh, video with me. And I was just like, this skirt is is like, they go together. So I was just like, and you know what we should do? We should pair it with, to like play around with patterns. We should put like a 
pinstripe shirt underneath it. So tell me why when I go to scroll down and you know, just to read the reviews on these skirts, tell me why somebody already had my look in mind. Like literally this exact sweater with this skirt and she had on a button down shirt with it. I was like, listen, great minds think alike. That's why I always tell people, I know there's a lot of videos out there like recreate Pinterest moments, but a lot of times you already have the looks in mind and you're probably just looking for I guess confirmation that what you have in mind is going to work and so you know you play around on Pinterest. I always start with what's in my head first and then I go to Pinterest to see if it's been done before sometimes but I've learned to just go with my own my own mind and so let me show you guys what this will look like together. Please hold. Now what I have done and hopefully you guys can see the moment is this skirt is just as long as the purple version, but what I have done is I have rolled her up a little bit and then tucked her under the elastic waist so we can have the shirt dress peeking out at the bottom. It's giving very much Jay Bolin, like I've been in his closet, he styled me. Um, he plays around a lot with this concept. I think there's also a boutique that was selling like, it was like, sweatshirt dress, sweater dress at the top, uh, pinstripe shirt at the bottom, or some abstract variation of that. One sleeve was sweater, the other sleeve was pinstripe. Very much a moment. As you can see, um, I have paired our placeholder bag. Let me stop. I feel like this would be cute with this, with a denim moment just because of the blue pinstripe. Um, of course we could play with any of our other bags but i just feel like this is it and i would go hmm when i revisit the birthday boots look hmm, maybe maybe birthday boots maybe not the white boots definitely not the white boots we probably could go here to the pistachio moment Maybe, hmm, possibly, what y'all, hmm, not feeling it. Um, we might keep it here. Yeah, we will probably keep it neutral. Yeah, we will probably go here with it. Yeah, I like this, this is cute, this, this is spring our little placeholder one day this will my denim collection will include there's two bags i have in mind but for right now this will do but yes this is a cute church moment but again we just want to have the shirt dress peeking out at the bottom and of course this will be the only shirt dress all of the amazon shirt dresses that i have those are the ones that have pockets the she and ones do not have pockets. But this is cute. The goal would be to be able to keep the skirt even so the dress is sticking out evenly. But yeah, I think you get the you get the point. With these roll gold rose gold shoes, I think this would be cute. I can't think of any shoes right now that come to mind. I mean, it would be cute if I had some gold boots, but your girl slept on, on uh, two pairs actually. So maybe, maybe one day. But let me know what you think of this look in the comments below. Okay, so we have another Target Black History Month HBCU challenge piece and some just regular degular jeans that I had in my closet that I need to wear more often. Would I usually pair this together? No, but I'm realizing that I'm off skinny jeans. And so I'm gonna try to see if I can make these two pieces work together. I'm wearing the glasses that I showed you guys, she in pieces. And so this t-shirt is a double XL. Um, 
these pants are a 1x or a 2x and then we have a size discovery from Shein. I have been stalking this sweater for some time from Shein. Um, I kept ignoring it because they, it only came in a size large and I was just like I don't know how a size large from Shein is going to fit me. Cut to me being at a basketball game for my nephews and I see a plus size girl wearing this sweater bigger than me okay wearing this sweater and I was just like girl order it and see 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 what happens and lo and behold she can fit a large who she in which is actually my size everywhere okay <laughs> all these one x's two x's girl try a large sometimes get your life together and so I'm thinking the only thing that's annoying is I'm happy that this sweater has pockets, but the pockets stick out. Like it's just irritating, but I'm happy it does have pockets. And as you can see, we are wearing green again, but there's green in the shirt. And so because the shirt is black, um, if I was wearing different jeans and this, this sweater, I've, I've been wanting to put this together for forever. My Adidas, with the green. That's the biggest reason why I wanted this sweater in the first place. And so if I was wearing different jeans, like what I think I would do is pull out my um, green camo cadet Kim uh, pants, put that with this and then wear it with these sneakers and then carry, one more mark, carry this bag. Um, yeah, I would probably put this look together with the camo pants but because um i am wearing these elevated casual jeans i would go here with yet another mary jane tap dance recital situation these are also she in and i probably will still carry this bag if not this bag then um I can go black and carry her or I can add yet another pop of color and reach for because it's right in front of my face and her sister is a little further away because it also has pink in it. I can go here and add more color. The world is our oyster. So we have some options. Let me see if I can reach her sister. <clears throat> yeah, so the world is our oyster with this tea because there are so many colors and then a black shoe. But again, it will be with, if I wear it with these jeans, yeah, we would keep it elevated with a heel. If I go the camo pants route, It'll be with the sneaker. Hoochie, I'm getting tired. I am thirsty. <laughs> How many looks do we have left? We have one, two, three. No, one, two, three looks left. So let me keep. I didn't even style that. <laughs> oh my goodness. Let me know what you think. Are y'all happy that I finally figured out what my real size is? Well, that I have size options. I don't always have to go the plus size side. I can go to the straight sizes, the mid, the mid sizes and find items as well. We got to do something about these pockets. Okay, y'all. Next slide, please. Okay. So Another Tarjay piece is a green girl, yes. Like I told y'all it's a lot of green. I tried to break it up, but I realized every time I went to reach for something, if it wasn't green, it had green in it, we're here. This Target Black History Month House of Ama. I started off with an extra, a double X. Something said go back to the store, try the extra large, we're here, okay? 
this is why I fight so much because your girl is built like Winnie the Pooh about the midsection. Hey, Apple Shapes out there. Hey, y'all. I see you. I understand the struggle, okay? Everything will fit until you get to the tummy area and you try not to highlight. You try to accentuate other areas and minimize here. I told y'all all the items that I've worn in this video have been without shapewear, this dress included. Y'all got me out here, okay? Y'all got me out here. This is this is not me. I need to be more snatched. We have more work to do. And so I'm trying not to go low hanging fruit, matchy matchy. So this bag does have hints of green. Now granted this dress is very much lime green and like a grass green, however, I don't know why I thought these boots would be a perfect match. These pistachio green boots <laughs> would be a perfect match. But I feel like I still would try to make it work just because that's why I bought this dress, thinking that they will be an exact match. Um, and they are not, <laughs> okay? By any, any shape or form. We could go here with it, but this don't match either, okay? This don't match either. So we're just gonna be creative. I will probably, because every bag that I've picked up so far has silver hardware, we probably could wear these glasses with this dress and these boots and this bag. If not this bag, we want to go smaller. This, this, this the name of this color uh, ombre was pale pistachio. And so we could go here with it. Let's try one of the boots on. Oh, I have a long yet. Do they have paper on? No, let's see here. Good job. It don't look bad. It's not, it don't, can y'all see? It don't look bad, but it's not like, yes, either, okay? Um, I feel like we could make it work. I feel like we can make it work. If we accessorize well enough, I feel like it could work. It could be a moment. We're off matchy matchy anyway. Y'all tell me what you think. How would you style this lime and grass green dress? Which I need to hurry up and get a wear out of before it's too hot for it. Tell me what you think. Would you go gold? Like a gold boot would, would, would give. A gold boot, yet again. Maybe I need to keep looking a gold boot that's the second outfit where a gold boot would hit it would give what it needed to give maybe a silk nope 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 we're gonna go with these boots yeah all right y'all we off this next slide please <laughs> oh hey girl how you doing just another shirt dress from amazon so this is the tan version of the Blue one I showed you guys, clearly fresh out the pack. Still has the tag on it. Still very much has the folds in it. Let's style her up really quickly. And so when I saw this dress, I immediately thought of these boots, okay? Yes, we are, we are going here with it, okay? My OTK boots that want to be ankle boots so bad. Um, now we could play around and put jeans under this shirt dress or we can just wear her as is with these boots. Let's see here. And one more piece that needs to be retired from my channel because I feel like at this point, every How To Style video, this item makes an appearance. Um, and so 
the idea another idea just crossed my mind as i was thinking about that but this is definitely a look i want to wear at some point Child. i feel like this boot is getting ready to embarrass me y'all <laughs> act like it ain't got no home training <laughs> This tan dress. With these boots and old faithful. It's definitely time to put her away anyway. This thing is so so hot. You would not need a coat with this. It's definitely time to put her away. She's done a photo shoot and she's made cameo in every How to Style video I feel. She is all over my channel, all over my website, on my Instagram. You see how I disappear as soon as I put this heel on? But yes, honey, this is a look. Again, I could put a skinny jean on with this or just wear it as a dress. The world is our oyster bag wise we could go and i'm annoyed with myself for pulling all this stuff down we can go here which is where i went for the photo shoot we could go here keep it neutral no purple tabby box bag we not using you for this look stay where i put you please <laughs> we could go actually we could go here we're going here the Michael Kors Manhattan because we never reach for her and she's a perfect match for the pink in the Guardian and so this is a moment yes honey if it was themed this would be a moment now since we are speaking of retiring this look let me restyle this really quickly please hold so just know there's about a two and a half hour break. <laughs> Not a two and a half hour. Maybe, yeah, a two and a half hour break between this clip and the last clip. Sister stopped, drank several bottles of water, had a whole chicken sandwich, watched the whole church service, and now we're back. <laughs> and the denim trench has entered the chat. So here we are. We have put away the soft fuzzy cardigan we have replaced her boot child, these, this one boot, this one boot. We are still wearing our leopard. And I'm thinking that I wanna add a hat. Now I need to take a page from every other influencer and I need to start hanging my hats instead of just having them stacked on top of each other. Now, whether or not I will go with this hat and this boot is a questionable move. This hat, I don't know, I paid $8 for it from Burlington. I, this hat has never done it for me. I need to let it go. Um, but I feel like this is the color I need for this look, but I feel like this style fedora might work better. It's just the wrong color. Let me see. Because this boot has, what color? It has various shades of brown. So I feel like even a chocolate brown fedora, which I do not own. Let's see here. Let's go here. I was trying to go here, but let's go here because I don't own a chocolate brown fedora. This is more of like a cognac color. Also, please note that my hair is about to change yet again. So after I'm done these last couple outfits I have to work on my hair at 908 and 
Saturday evening, okay? Saturday night. So this could work. Y'all even see. I feel like this is this could be a moment with what bag? We need we need accessories. What bag could go with this? Um with these boots. It's a lot of patterns. We have the stripes, we have the leopard. We must keep it muted. We need brown. We can't do signature print anything. That's too many prints and patterns. I mean, do you walk on the wild side if you choose to? No. Um, let's see here. I didn't want to go here, but we probably should just keep it here. In real time, I would not put these together, but I feel like y'all get the point. A nice little necklace or something. Accessorize about the neckline. Accessorize, accessorize, accessorize. But y'all get it. Just tell me what you think. Definitely a different color hat. I would go chocolate brown. To pull out the leopard print a little bit more. I will go chop, chop. My feet are killing me. I will go chocolate brown. Okay. But yes. Tell me what you think in the comments. Would you? Are you feeling? What is this giving you? Next slide, please. Oh hey girl, what you doing? Nothing. Just hanging out. Yet another shirt dress. So this is the pink version of the red shirt dress I showed you guys earlier. This is a Shein find. We have one more, it is not styled. I'm not styling it. I feel like we get it at this point. Shirt dresses are very versatile, very versatile moments. And so when I saw this shirt dress, I was like, yes. No, actually what happened was after I got the black striped shirt dress, I showed you, what I'll probably try to do is put maybe a clip from the vlog or something so you can see how I, I styled that one. But I basically went back and, no, actually a Facebook ad showed me that they added other colors to the Shein collection. And so I basically just got all the colors Shein had to offer because the Shein shirt dresses were about 10 to, dare I say $12 cheaper than the Amazon dresses. So I just got all the all the dresses she had to offer. Had this in my cart. And then somehow, some way, this was suggested to me. Now again, this is from the straight sizes. This is not plus size. This sweater is an, I wanna say a large, This sweater is an extra large. And so this sweater actually came in red with the pink. I was like, oh, that'd be cute for Valentine's Day. It didn't have my size. And that's a good thing because I realized I had a whole pink and white striped, pink, red and white striped sweater um, already. And then I had a red sweater dress that I ended up wearing for Valentine's Day. So it worked out perfectly. I didn't need it, but Let's discuss this moment, shall we? Let's let's discuss this, okay? This this look here. Now again, the sweater, the pinstripes are pink and white. From far away, it could be very much pink and cream or pink and off white. However you choose to style it. But I just thought this would be so cute together. I really wish I had these glasses in gold. If you guys want a fashion glasses video from me, I think we discussed this already. I think some of you already said yes. But for those of you who didn't get the opportunity to vote, put your ballot, put your ballot in the comments below. Let me know if you want fashion glasses video. I have several pairs, but this is a moment. And I feel like you know where we're going as far as the bag is concerned. 
because where else would we go? Where else would we go? Other than our XXL and pink. Where, where else would we go? Now the thing is the shoe. The shoe moment. Let's let's just let's work on that because we could go here again with the Mr. Brown's fashionable daughter boot. This could work, or we could go here with yet another tap dance recital production. <laughs> Why do you have so many shoes made like this, girl? Child, I don't know. These were also she in finds uh, last year. This would be cute together. This gives spring. Why are these like almost a perfect match for this bag? So we will probably keep it here. It's very matchy matchy. I would prefer to go more fashion forward and do this. I feel like the, mm, I don't know, it's this black, the black heel. It's throwing it off. I feel like honorable mention would be the rose gold just because of the metallic in the bag. Oh. Now it's reading gold up against all of this. In my mirror is rose gold, on camera is reading gold. I don't know. But the shoe would definitely have to be either a match or a neutral. Yes, honey. This sweater again is from the straight sizes. The dress is plus size. All things work together. Girl, what size do you wear? All things work together. All the sizes work together. <laughs> okay, I love the length. Love the colors. It just is what it is. And again, what other bag would do for this look? Let me know what you think in the comments below. Now, before I put on the last and final look to close out the video, this is the dress I did not even style ask me why because it's olive green it's the same dress i'm wearing now but olive green pinstripe and so listen there's so many things i could do with this i probably would style this with like a camel jacket um black shoes black bag i have none of that in front of me now and for that reason I'm not gonna bother. We've, we've done enough green in this video. Low key, if I wanted to, I could put these two together and create the same look, carry the same pink bag and do, stuff is just all over the place. The pink shoe. Like that's a, a exact match. That's crazy. These, did I tell you guys these are she in as well? Yeah, so listen, we get it, we get it. That's enough with the shirt dresses. Um, the other item that I did not style is this item here. I was so hyped when I found this. It was supposed to be a football season. <sighs> football season outfit, but once we got to the playoffs and it was grand opening, grand closing, I didn't get a chance to wear this. <laughs> and so I'm not even gonna style it for this video, but you guys will see, what is that? You guys will see this look at some point on my channel. This sweater is a size, more likely it's a 1X. This is the, a plus size fine. Yeah, she and curve, so it's a 1X. And so there you have that nice little open cardigan, twinkle, twinkle, cowboy star. Okay, there you have it. Okay, now we are getting ready to get into our last and final look. Thank the Lord. <laughs> okay, <laughs> I'm tired of clothes. And I, I just, <sighs> the aftermath of these videos, having to put all this stuff away. 
Okay, so I've decided that after all of that razzle dazzle, just giving the looks, we're gonna close out with an elevated casual moment, which I have decided that this will be my outfit for work on Monday, Lord willing. Laura C. Fit and the Creek Don't Rise, I make it to Monday. This is gonna be my work outfit. And so, listen, tag still attached to everything. Yes, you are reading that correctly. If you see members mark, yes, this came from Sam's Club, okay? These long sleeve tees, when I realized Sam's had, right now they're selling the t-shirts, but I, I love the long sleeve tees. This color is called Victorian Mall. And so this t-shirt, I feel like was the perfect match for these elevated casual wide leg with pockets, sweatpants from the Target, from Target by Wild Fable. These sweatpants are in the color Nougat Tan. They were extra large. I found the black pair, which in my opinion is very much charcoal gray. I don't care what anyone says, they're charcoal gray to me. I found those first. I've worn them more times than I'd like to admit. And I've had them for, let's see, about three weeks, maybe. Hmm. I found them on, was it before Valentine's Day or a little bit after? And so this is, yeah, a little under a month and I've worn them so many times. Um, and so I was like, well, I need the tan ones. And low key, us thick thigh girls who know that after a while I wear sweatpants pill, I feel like I need to get an extra pair in both, unless they release other colors. But this is a moment. Now, the shoe for this look will be these. Adidas, my Adidas, okay? These are the shoes, we are. We already know. These, are, these will be the shoes, okay? Now, as far as completing the look, we could go here, which this is um, from another Shein haul already posted. The match of this sweater to this long sleeve t-shirt was just perfection, okay? Now, we could go out like this, but the way this weather is set up will probably Add this on top because again, I don't want to walk around saying I want to bury white again. So we'll probably go here with it. And then if it gets hot, we'll just take off the extra sweater. And we may or may not, depending on the weather, that day in the morning and this scarf which is from is this boo or burlington one of them b stores it's either boohoo or burlington it's giving very much chanel it's giving boucle it has all the colors in it so we'll go here We'll probably add some glasses. Again, I really wish these glasses came in gold. I probably should have got the sunglasses version with the pink tinted lens. We'll probably add a nice little fashion frame. And then this will be the carry. Our Richmond shopper tote. A moment, honey, a moment, okay? Yes, this is giving. This is, this is giving. This is giving everything that needs to be given. Everything that needs to be gave. Elevated casual. Very much throw on and go. Listen. I'm not feeling the sweater, so we're gonna mix the sweater. Yeah, I'm not feeling the sweater. The sweater is taking away from the moment. So we're gonna lose the sweater. 
Now, I will say this, the sweater could work on the weekends when we are running errands and we're just like in and out of the car and we can go here with it, okay? This is, this is weekend, okay? Um, this could be work. And then also, this is work. I love this so much better. Yes, honey, this is so much better. Now the hardware on the trench is silver, but we're going gold. We're gonna go for the gold. And this is a moment we would have to lose these glasses because they only match the buttons. So we will probably go gold, accessories oh, yes this is it listen y'all when i tell you even in a sh in a heel even in a shoe these sweatpants touch the ground i just they're just so so classy chic so classy chic there's no drawstring to fuss with it's just pull on and go throw on and go yes honey this trench is an extra large. Did I buy my wrong size initially? Of course, I started off with a double X, came to my senses, went back and got the extra large. And for that, we are grateful. This is what she looks like in the back. And so there you have it. If I wanted to do the most, I absolutely could, but no. These are rose gold. I would have to pick a different bag. Like if I wanted to make this work, I would probably have to go here. Tell me what you think in the comments below. And that concludes today's video. If you have enjoyed this video, let me know what you think in the comments below. Again, thank you so much for stopping by my channel. If you know another girly who would enjoy the content on my channel, don't be stingy, don't be a gatekeeper. Share this video with her so she too can click the like button, subscribe button, notification bell, so she can stay tuned for all things faith and fashion on my channel. Again, my name is Anitra with Different by Design, where faith and fashion connect, and you have a great week.